Yeah. Yep. It's been two long years. Man, you do not know. This is the fair I usually go to every year. If you remember, it's... If you did not know, uh, I, it got canceled last year due to COVID. And now it's back on for this year. So, excellent. I'm walking down the midway right now. What an incredible thing. It is so... Um, it's exciting that I'm back here. For, um, after being canceled last year. Um, oh, it's exciting. I'm finally back here. So you'll see a lot of footage. Let me so that the video is going to be different from past ones. It's going to be a lot less of me talking, but more footage of the of the atmosphere here. So that's something I'm looking forward to. Once the midway gets all set up here and the rides all start and everything, you'll see a lot more footage. A lot. I'm trying to get more into the footage game than just the talk point of view thing. So yeah, so. All right, so, um, I've been here for a bit now. A lot of things have changed um, this year. Um, but, um, yeah, I have the standard shaved ice. But anyway, I'm walking around here. Um, so, a lot of things are really um, very good this year. Not as many people. Um, you might see some people pop up in the video soon. Uh, depends. Depends on who you think, but, um... It's great to be back. I missed it last year. There's the Reddington Christian Church youth band playing in the background. It's a church in uh, Seymour. Near, near Seymour. It's a Reddington Christian Church. It's a great church. But... Anyway, I'm going to show you some things that are new this year. All right, so the first thing that's new this year is um, the St. Ambrose booth is no longer that. It's actually my old church, Brownstown Christian Church, has the uh, booth this year. They're starting it this year, and they do pulled pork and stuff. And it's right across from the uh, pavilion in the St. Peter's Taco House from St. Peter's Lutheran Church. And anyway, that's nice. It's really nice. Oh, look, it's Windseeker. <laughs> Windseeker, no, no, that's a star flyer. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a star flyer. Yeah, it's not Windseeker, it's called Vertigo. See, look, Vertigo. Yep, it's a star flyer <laughs> type ride. Another one thing that's new is two, two rides are missing. You know, new, that used to be over there. Right there was supposed to be a giant frisbee called Freak Out, and right here was where the Larson Loop was. Which, no, it's not a coaster. And, and yes, I did see the kid who was in my video two years ago who kept calling it a coaster. Yes, I did see him. <laughs> but, Brayden, if you're watching this, it's not a coaster, <laughs> so anyway, but um, anyway, so there's Black Widow, which is basically Monster, <laughs> but hey, it's Spider. I'm, I'm working at Kings Island. I hear people call Monster Spider all the time, so hey, this one works. So anyway, that's here at Kings Island. This is another thing we need, a giant Ferris wheel. That's something we could use. Yeah, <laughs> but make it three times this size like Cedar Point's. Okay, it is the next day. I haven't filmed too much yesterday because we left early, but okay, here I am. It is like 6.20 p.m. on Tuesday. We're only gonna be here for one more day. And this is like my last day here. We're not staying here much this time because I have to work on a Wednesday. We're gonna head back, but anyway. 
So, I am back here at the Jackson County Fair for the second day. I'm gonna be here at night this time, but I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna, I will get a ride wristband and do some riding. However, I'm, a lot of this video is gonna be focused on filming, getting ride footage. Look, I'm gonna do a lot of footage of the rides. I might try and block out some of the music because of copyright reasons and just put background music over it. I might be doing that, but anyways, so if you see a, a scene, if you see the scenes with background music, it's not just be me wanting to ruin the atmosphere. It's just I don't want to get in copyright trouble on YouTube. So anyway, so I'm just walking around a little bit. I'm not going to have dinner till like 645 or so. It's going to be and I'll see if I can feature some people here eventually. So, anyway. great photo shots of the rides or video actually got a lot of video I hope you enjoyed the footage so, so far it'll be even better once it gets dark out I'll be doing some more footage when it's dark out so it's awesome so so far I've seen a bunch of people I know which is a good thing I haven't seen a lot of these people in two years which was the last time they had a fair which if you haven't already I recommend going and checking out those um, those I have a Jackson County Fair playlist that I added last year as the fair was canceled I added a playlist last year for the fair which features a lot of nice videos and this will be added to it so definitely check out my any fair video which would which would range from the drum solo in 2016 to the vlog in 2019 which was two years ago so I highly recommend checking them out so go gotta have one more ribeye sandwich before I head back home that's this is what I trap this is what I come here for travel all the way from Cincy just to get this ribeye sandwich gotta have one more of it before I go all right so the sandwich was good just finished that up so now I'm gonna do it's now dark I'm gonna go ahead and go down onto the midway and let's get some night footage going yeah let's get some night footage of the of the midway
great time at the fair. There's a, there's an there's earthquake. Just an earthquake. Not just kidding. Just J K. Got ya. That'll do it. Um, I'm about to leave. Um, I'm about to leave the fair for this year. We only did two days this year. I mean, it was great. It was great to be back after it not being here last year. And man, I will say a lot of people have changed so much that seeing them like this now and coming back here, it's just really cool. I will say, that as a ride operator, there were some things that I did notice that I wasn't the best about. I will not go into detail about that, but I will say that the operators um, for Poor Jack, I'm not going to do anything about them at all. I am not going to on them at all. I think they did a fine job. However, there were some things I noticed that as a ride operator, Kings Island is a no-no. <laughs> and that we do it differently, especially with Cedar Fair standards. So, anyway, thank you guys for watching this video. It was gr it's great to be back here, and I plan to hopefully come back next year. Definitely hope to come back next year in 2022. So, it'll be awesome. Quick thing here is that um, I have some great content coming up soon. I have a Carowinds trip coming soon. I also plan to do some things around... Kings Island when I'm in there as a guest I might do some fun little pop-up videos pop-up little vlogs kind of thing that's something you can look forward to anyway it's great to be here so comment below if you have been to this fair or if you were here this week and let me know your favorite part about this fair I will see you guys soon.